Hey, check this out. Fucking shit! Did you see that? Huh, what? Oh, sorry, I wasn't looking. Today's the day, honey! It's time! Huh. I guess we could still adopt. All right, class. Time to get on the bus so we can visit ancient Rome. Oh, we can't forget Liz. <laughs> class? What do you mean they're gone? I don't know what happened. One minute they were there, and then... Do you know what this means, Miss Frizzle? <gasps> oh, God. Those kids could be anywhere. Inside anyone. <gasps> at any point in time. No! <laughs> oh, my gosh. This is wonderful. somewhere else? This place is for kids. I feel weird. Ooh. Oh my god, a ball pit! Can I play in the ball pit? Please? Please? James, you are 25 years old. People are staring. Can we please leave? Just five more minutes! Shush! Okay, okay, okay. Five more minutes and that's it! Woohoo! Who, who the hell are you? It's me! It's James! From the future! What? There's no time. You need to listen. When we leave here, there's going to be a terrible car accident. I end up with this nasty scar, but you... You... I can't lose you again! I can't live alone! I just... Don't get in that car! Don't! Don't get in that car! <laughs> that was fun! <laughs> but I guess it's time to leave. I, I think we should stay here a little while longer. I need a minute. Okay. <laughs> hey, thanks for the assist, buddy. No, thank you. <laughs> Whee! <laughs> oh, you're in trouble now, Paladin. Roll your d20 and let us see if you live or die. Oh, jeez. Huh. Oh. <gasps> oh my God! Thank you! You saved my life! Oh, Jesus! I roll! <laughs> Ready?
Ready, son? Dad, I don't want Fishy to go. <sighs> I know how you feel, but death, it's just a fact of life. It's time you learned. <laughs> All right, son, down he goes. But, Dad, it, it's Mr. Fuzzy. We talked about this. Fact of life. <laughs> I don't know if I can do it, Dad. <laughs> you must remember, son. <laughs> it's a fact of life. Dad, no. Don't worry, son. I'm going down to the sewers to hang out with the Ninja Turtles. What? Dad, th the Ninja Turtles aren't real. What? No. No! What's going on? Where am I? Ah! Is that a lit match in my dick? Hello, George. You're probably wondering how you ended up in such a compromising circumstance. But salvation can still be yours. Uh. If you cleanse yourself clean of your mindless habits. For too long you have taken for granted the pleasures of everyday life without consideration to what it would feel like to have a lit match inserted directly into your urethra. Now it's time for you to pay for your fortuitousness, going about your life without the realization that one day, you will have struck a match protruding from your dick, slowly burning down like your ignorant, careless life. Do you see the folly of your ways now, George? Do you see how negligent you've been to the possibility of sudden, inexplicable scenarios? Will you save your penis? The clock's ticking, George. Soon you will. What are you thinking about? Oh, sorry, I... I was just lost in thought. You know, thinking about how glad I am to not have a lit match stuck in my dick. Yeah, weird thought, I know. Huh? Mm. Ah. A cemetery. Better hold your breath. Huh? Hold your breath while we pass the cemetery, or the dead will get jealous. save you now! <laughs> Let me go! You can't do this! Yeah. 
Yes, I can! I'm literally doing it already! <laughs> Wow! It really looks like no one's coming to save you. Hmm. No, no, no! Oh, 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 oh! 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 my god! Oh! Hey! Uh, sorry to bother you. Did, did we get any intruders today, by chance? Oh yeah, boss. A guy came to rescue his girlfriend, but don't worry, I did exactly what you told me to, and I shot him! Ha! Ah. Yes. I see. D did I do a good job, boss? Boss? Hey, boss! I made your favorite! Crane brulee! Uh, you, you haven't eaten in a while, so I figured, uh, uh I'll just leave this here. <laughs> Public intoxication, stealing from a hospital, brawling in the street, and now we've got you in possession of 13 missing children. That's a felony quantity! I could try you as an adult for that, because of course you are an adult! <laughs> Where are the last two missing kids, huh? Where? Oh. <laughs> Give me the old silent, giggling treatment, huh? <laughs> well, two can play at that game. A tee hee, a tee hee hee. Not to worry. The kidnapper was described as a tall, hmm, Caucasian, hmm, with a goofy <laughs> smile, hmm. And a funny little hat. Hm. Does any of that sound familiar? What? You're not. I'm so sorry, sir. There must have been some kind of mistake. You don't look anything like the suspect. You're free to go. I'll have the deputy drive you home. The kidnapper was described as a tall Caucasian with a goofy smile and a funny little head. That is not what I thought was going to happen. Listen up, boys. Tonight's the big night. Are you ready to go out there and win this thing? Let's go, yeah. team. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You fellas know the drill. I need your urine first, then we play. A drug test? But, coach. We're not taking any steroids or nothing. Honest! Hey, let me tell you something doesn't matter. Everyone starts pissing in a cup right now, and then get your asses on that field. Let's go! Yeah! That's what I'm talking about, baby! Football! See, coach? We lost! Oh, did we now? Yeah! <laughs> Congrats, oh, everyone! Oh, what the hell is that smell? Oh, 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 what the fuck? Oh, hello, everyone. Hey, Luigi, what's up, man? How's it hanging, Luigi? Yeah, hey, bro. I hope you don't mind. I invited my friend along. This is Waluigi. <laughs> hello. Uh, are, are you serious? Huh? Are you joking me with this right now? What you talking about, Luigi? Yeah, what's up? You don't see it? Is uh, this a prank? What? Huh, he's an evil me. Dude, it's just Waluigi. His name is a Waluigi. That just means bad Luigi. 
Oh, because you're so good. Do you know how self-centered you sound right now? Yeah, I mean, we've known him longer than you, so... Maybe he's the good Luigi and you're the bad one. Look, it is a clove. Hey, stop! This was supposed to be a fun day of Mario Golf and, congratulations, you're ruining it. Oh, and he stole my debit card. Oh, yeah. I have found this on the ground and I wanted to return it to you. Also, I bought everyone a pizza with it. Hey, what's up, dude? Nice. Huh? You're being a gigantic asshole right now, Luigi. No, he's the asshole. <laughs> Luigi, come on, man. You're making him cry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey! What was that? You'll do not see that. <laughs> Fuck golf! Let's go play some Mario Tennis. Come on, Waluigi! Unbelievable, yeah, let's man. Go. Luigi, I'm... I, I didn't mean to... <laughs> Happiness doesn't just fall in our laps, folks. You gotta put in the work and meet it halfway. Your goal this month is to make everything on this list a reality. Hmm. Now, I know you're thinking. Ty, don't I have to be rich to do all of these? And the answer to that is yes. Hmm. To become rich, purchase my 12-course program. Link in the description. Oh, you must have heard the news. Oh, what news? Oh, uh, well, it's about your family's annual retreat. Thank God you couldn't make it this year. Family retreat? Weird. I've never gotten an invitation. Yeah, whole family got together, everyone had a real great time. Such a great time that their laughter attracted bears that slaughtered them all. <coughs> Which is why I'm here. None of them was rich per se, but you appear to be last of kin to about... 900 people? I hope these millions of dollars can bring you some happiness in your time of mourning. My condolences. Guess there's just one thing left to try. There he is, Rich Larry. Hey, thanks for inviting me over. I had to see for myself. Pretty swanky, Larry. Wow, you've killed so many things. Plus, you got married and divorced. You must be so happy. Congrats. What's, uh, what's this one for? Hmm. Do I smell turducken, Larry? Does your wealth know no bounds? Larry, this is incredible. What I'd give to have your riches. <laughs> Take it. I'll say that again, Larry. You're, uh, <laughs> you're a little far away, buddy. Y you can have all of it. If I've learned anything, it's that money will never buy happiness. I'm so happy! <laughs> Honey, kids, we're rich! We don't have to live in the walls anymore! <laughs> Alright, yeah! <laughs> really, Larry? Why can't you be happy for me, you sad, poor piece of shit? <laughs> Smith, a noble quest is afoot. There's a princess to save and a nasty dragon to slay. I'll need you to forge me a mighty sword. Ha <laughs> ha! Fear not, fearless hero. I've already prepared just the sword for- No! Mightier, I say. But, but my lord- Mightier! What 
the fuck is that? What the fuck? Stop! Ow! Ow! Fuck! Ah! Oh, fuck! At last, the final piece! And now the handsomest boy in town is all... Uh... Ugh. Hello, pretty lady! Fancy a date? Uh, I think we should just be friends. Bye! Dang! She gave me a heart and then ripped it right out again. Well, I guess now it's just lonely old Harry the Handsome Butcher? Who, who am I? One hot dog, please! Hmm. Hmm. Aha! Hello! I'd like my old job back. Minimum wage will do. Old job? Sir, you are a person who I have not seen before, and I never forget a face. This one. It's this face. It's me, Harry the Handsome Butcher. Handsome? Ha! Buddy, you're the least handsome guy I've ever seen. And the second least butcher. Me? Not handsome? Hey, everyone! Look how normal this guy looks. And he wants a job here at a grocery store? <laughs> <laughs> He's comically non-handsome. I would never fuck him. Hey, ugly McDeep shit. The circus is hiring. Really? Um, uh, no. It's a figure of speech. I was dissing you, man. I'm sorry. I mean, maybe the circus is hiring. I don't know. It, it could be hiring. Then there's no time to lose. Great show, Harry. Your total averageness and forgettable appearance are an absolute delight. We are sold out for weeks. Great job. You fucking freak. Sigh. I must be the saddest man in the world. No. I'm the saddest man in the world. Oh, hello, sad man! It's Larry. Hi, Larry. I'm Harry. How'd you end up as a circus freak? Is it because of how ugly and dumb you are? Oh, I just ran out of options, I guess. I tried making friends. I tried making love. I even won the lottery once. But nothing made me happy. I guess the world isn't built for folks like you and me. Oh, hey there, handsome. I think you're right, sad boy. But maybe, if we keep believing, we can find a place where we truly belong. What the? What's going on? I have no idea. Hey, fellow grown-up, do you know what's happening? Eh. I'm so confused. Hi, confused. I'm Airplane Dad. Everyone shut up! Look! A spooky clown house! Perhaps there's answers in there? Huh. What 
the devil! We need to get out of here! Into there! Where's out? What's in? Ah! My family. They're alive. You know the best part of this family reunion? Besides the Brewskis? Sad Larry isn't here. Exactly! Man, that guy's one sad bastard. <laughs> yeah. Larry not being here is the main reason I feel happy right now. Besides the Brewskis. Hey, a toast to Sad Larry. The reason we're all alcoholics. <laughs> hey, cheers, babe. <laughs> Wait. Is that a herd of bears coming towards us? Uh, I think it's called a fuck. Hey, John, what's the term for a group of... <laughs> this is still better than hanging out with Sad Larry! <sighs> oh. Oh. No. Is this? Shh. Oop. Do you take this Boeing 737 to be your primary mode of transportation in both fair weather and stormy conditions and promise to keep her safe within your flight manual maintenance specifications? I do. Thank you for choosing Plain Jane Airlines. You may kiss the bride. I'll never let anything happen to you. You left me! You left me to die! No, no! It wasn't my fault! No! Please forgive me! Okay. The real question is, who are you? Me? I'm Harry the Handsome. Prison warden, criminal, computer repairman. You've done so much, but become so little. Look at you. You are not even handsome anymore. But I'm still Harry, though. Harry the Butcher. Are you a butcher? Of course I am. I'm the greatest butcher in the world! I graduated top of my class from butcher school! But you never went to butcher school, Harry. You bought your degree from a strange man in an alley. Remember? Oh no! But it was my job! And you were terrible at it. You cut your own face off and gave it to a customer on your first day at work and then got fired. But if I'm not handsome... And I'm not a butcher. Then I'm, I'm... Nothing. No! No, no, no! Birthday party? You kidnapped us to bring us to your birthday party? I'm honored. No one's ever invited me to a birthday party before.
It seems on Clown Planet, clapping is considered inappropriate. Noted. Oh, I bet they're having so much fun in there. What the hell are you looking at? Buddy, come on, none of us have eaten. Do you, do you mind if I just... Hey, 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 oh, 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 hey, oh, oh, what's the pepperoni, ah! Huh, on Clown Planet, it's rude to take pizza without asking. That's true everywhere. Hmm. Fascinating. <laughs> Once again, everyone gets to be happy except old Larry. Stupid party, stupid clown. Just like mine. He's... he's all alone. I can't take this anymore, Harry. We need to get out of here. Don't worry, I'm sure it'll be over soon. How long can a birthday party last? Aha! Uh -huh. On Clown Planet, birthday parties last an eternity. Enough! I get it! I can't do this anymore, Harry! I'm so tired! So hungry! Then let's end this party! Harry, be careful! I don't have to be careful. I'm a butcher. I know my way around a... Uh, um... A, a pointy, cutty thing. Ow! Whoa, that was weird. Anyway, I, I know I'm not invited, but, but I just wanted to say, you've been through a lot of shitty stuff these past infinity years, silly clown. And that sucks a lot, but heh, I'm glad we all got to be here and celebrate your birthday together. I, I love you. Silly good fellow, for, for he's, he's a, a silly, silly good, good fellow. fellow. For, for he's, he's a, a silly, silly good fellow. fellow. Hey, who nobody can deny. And then the most incredible thing happened. After eons of loneliness, that horrific cosmic clown realized he had a family again. And he hugged each of us for 24 hours. Then we had cake, and afterwards he gave each of us a birthday present, which is how birthdays work on Clown Planet. Airplane Dad got a new plane, Harry got his handsomeness back, and admission to butcher school. The tall boys became tall men and got an MBA contract. And before we knew it, we were on our way home. Do you think we'll ever see Silly again? And 
And what was your gift, Larry? <laughs> well, the greatest gift of all. Happiness. Huh? You're happy now? That Larry's happy? The saddest man in the world? What did it, Larry? Was it exercise? <gasps> it, it was the pills, right? Larry, you must tell me. How'd you do Come it, Larry? Larry? Tell us, tell us. We gotta know, we gotta know. Actually, it was clown magic. I am so sick of your shit, Larry. <laughs> Hey, Dad. I'm boy. I reached out to the whole family and look, we raised enough money for the procedure. You can finally die with dignity. I'm ready to go to the light. I'm smelling burnt toast. Isn't that a sign of a stroke? It's just the toast I burnt. Oh, thank God. <laughs> so how'd you burn it anyway? I forgot about it when you started having your stroke. Blue hoo hoo! A blue hoo hoo! I can't believe my dad is dead! My cloud dad! <laughs> At least I'll always have the memories. Oh, hello, Milton. Oh, my boy. Dad, you're alive? Nope, I'm very dead. This is just your memory of me. Wow, this is functionally the same thing as you being alive. Nope, totally dead. But don't be sad, son. You'll always have the memory of your cloud dad. That's me. Plus, don't forget, your human mom is still alive. I have a human mom? Uh, you seem very surprised. Everyone has a mom, Milton. It's called reproduction, stupid. You never taught me about that! Well, it's never too late to learn! The year was 1983, and I was a hip, young cumulus. Hey, how are my own thoughts revealing information that I didn't previously know? Shut up! So there I was, on top of the world. And that's when I saw her. All right, are you ready to jump? Yeah! Hello, woman. You are very attractive. I'm Claude. Hey, Claude. I'm a sexually liberated woman. It's the 80s, woo! <laughs> Indeed it is. Are you looking for a serious relationship? <laughs> it's a cloud bun! You're so funny. Let's have a kid. Ready when you are. Ooh, Geronimo! Oh, I can't wait to tell my son about how fucking weird cloud sex is. Ah, 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 no, please, no more. Ah, I don't want to hear any more. Ah. Okay, okay, Jesus. Wait a minute. I thought you said you weren't my real cloud dad. Well, that's the thing. She did it with like six other clouds on the way down. have six other dads? Yes, but they're all a bunch of deadbeats. I'm the only one who stuck around. Anyway, goodbye. <sighs> I can't believe I have six more cloud dads and one human mom. M my son? Is that you? <gasps> mom! Oh, Milton. Why are you in a tree? Your tornado dad threw me up here. Tornado Dad! Excuse me, 
me, sir. What do you think you're doing? Oh, I was just gonna use the bathroom. Sorry, sir. This is the first class bathroom. You'll have to use the other bathroom. Huh. <clears throat> Sorry, sir. This bathroom is reserved for the economy class. You'll have to use the other one. Ugh. Your poor ass can't use this bathroom. You have to use the bathroom in last class. What's the matter with you? Your co-star is hot, hot, hot. Why aren't you hard, hard, hard? Uh, I'm sorry. I, I think I'm just nervous. Nervous? What's to be nervous about? Just read the cue cards. It's not that. It, it's the live studio audience. Oh, and I'm shy. <laughs> Just imagine them all in their underwear. Or completely naked. <laughs> that always gets me going. Now get back out there, stud. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, you got it, boss. And uncut. Oh. All right, this isn't working. Uh, somebody come get them off. Ah, oh, man, I missed the orgy cruise. Well, I guess that's almost as good. And now, for the moment you've all been waiting for, the election of our new mayor! Let's meet our candidates. Scissors at the ready. First one to cut the ribbon of our new town hall wins. Let the mayorathon begin! He's got a gun! Dear God, every four years with this. Hey! The court will now come to order. Don't worry. Whatever strategy they use, we're prepared. Yeah. Hmm. Truth or dare? Uh. Truth? Did you. <clears throat> Kill a guy with a hammer? <laughs> uh, can I switch to dare? I'll allow it. Hmm. I dare you to kill that guy with a hammer. Uh. Enjoyed this? Be sure to visit explosum.net for more.